hi guys welcome back to another vlog and welcome to a very sunny liverpool i just got the train in um i'm quickly popping into south stream green because there's a couple of little gift bits that i need to get but um i'm getting my hair done today so i thought we could do a little bit of a hair update oh i'm out of breath i like power walked up from the train so i'm a little bit tired but yeah here we are at south stream green so many cute little gift bags. This is so cute. Look at this one. <laughs> and lots of cute Easter egg bits. I love these little pink candles. They're cute. And so many goodies. And I'm trying really hard not to look and like buy anything. But there's so many cute bits. Like look how cute this is. I have no gift to give to anyone to put in that, but I want it. So happily. I'm trying not to look. Obviously failing. Um, I'm trying to like bypass everything because I've got what I need and this is it like I'm not buying anything else okay let's go because I want to go to flannels and um, look at the sunglasses that they have because I love sunglasses the sun's coming out and I'm going to Dubai in a couple of months and we'll see if there's any sunglasses that I might need okay Erin's done i can't believe that i got two gift bags and a card oh my god the sun for two pound 40 which is absolutely ridiculous so those are the like actual or well, that was the only like actual errand that i needed to run today so yeah like i said i'm just gonna head to flannels have a little look because i am a sunglasses girly and I really want to treat myself to something. <laughs> My sister actually texted me the other day saying like, I really want to make a luxury purchase. And if you get it, you get it. Like I'm so in the mood to make a luxury purchase. I don't know or don't think it's going to happen, but um, I really want to. So let's just go and have a little look, see what there is. Um, and then we will head to the hairdressers. I've just kind of tried to scrape my hair back without putting too much product in it so that I can have it bleached so I hope Helen won't be too mad about me. Here we are, let's head in and have a little look to see what they have. Pacino is looking quiet, we all know how I feel about Pacino, I'm completely obsessed with this restaurant. There's so many to choose from, this is like heaven. I saw these glasses the other week. Oh my god, my hair's a mess. Anyway, we saw these glasses the other week and I really love them. They're also on sale. I do really love these. I think they look really cool. What do we think? I might have done it! I just had a beautiful consultation in Dior, which I absolutely loved, but I had to cut short because oh, I'm now late for my hairdresser's appointment, which is terrible. I'm never late and I hate being late, so I'm power walking to the hairdressers, but I had an amazing consultation at Dior, so I'm gonna go back to Dior another time. I have my contact details, so they're gonna arrange an appointment with me to go through sort of all their fragrances and hopefully potentially find a wedding fragrance. Okay, we're here. I don't know how I managed to be here like five minutes late, but here we are. So we're doing a half head today. My hair's not really growing very much, I don't feel. Helen is quite happy with my hair, but I absolutely hate it. It's just to get us to the wedding, so hopefully in the next six months this will be all chopped off. So yeah, just a half head, so hopefully I will be done relatively quickly. 
soon, whatever, and then just a little trim off the ends because these ends are horrible and wispy. I can't wait to cut it back into a bob. But half head, then I've got some more shopping to do, and I might take myself out for a little lunch. I don't know. I think it'd be quite cute to take myself for a little like solo date lunch. Hair is all done, looking bright and blonde, which I'm loving, but obviously I don't like the length, but we have to keep the length to be able to do more with it for the wedding. So it's just something I have to learn to live with. I'm just heading in to Liverpool One, just to have a little look, see if there's any bits that might be nice for Dubai. And then, I don't know, I feel like kind of, I'm, I don't feel ready to go home. I feel like I might, go and get like some lunch and read my book somewhere so that might be the little plan for this afternoon feeling a little bit uninspired there's some things that I've seen online that looked absolutely gorgeous but they didn't have them in store so that was a little bit annoying um yeah I'm really hungry I'm starting to lose motivation even though I literally just said that I was looking forward to like go out and do a bit more because I just wasn't ready to go home what I'm thinking is I might go and find a quiet little corner somewhere to read my book and it's getting towards three o'clock now I think so I don't want anything heavy to eat I would have a salad but I can't find anywhere really that have really nice salads I loved going to Bouchon on Castle Street but it's closed now which is so annoying so I can't go there for a salad so I'm just gonna get some chips because I really want some chips so I'm gonna find a nice little quiet corner have some chips read my book and go home in like an hour or so. I think we're gonna do Baccaro. I haven't been here in ages, so let's do this. So I think I'm just gonna get the chips and the salad, because the salad sounds really nice. Um, but I feel, because I'm so hungry at this point, I feel like I need a bit more than just salad, so. I'm gonna get the chips to go with it. I'm like, I'd love that, but I absolutely hate fennel, so we're not doing that. The hummus sounds nice, but like, I'm not that bothered. The tender stem broccoli would be really nice as well, and they got corona padano on it. Ooh. Oh no, I don't know what to do. This is bright, but hi, I just got home um, and I thought I would do a quick unboxing of my sunglasses from Flannels um, just because I need to end this vlog because I'm in a rush to edit and upload it. So I'm going to do that right now. But the lovely, lovely girls in Flannels give me so many samples. It's ridiculous. First of all, um, I have a load of Dior samples that are stuck together. I've got Holy Peony, not samples, testers, whatever, which I absolutely love. And I've loved that for years. And um, I've just dropped it on the floor. And I've loved it for so long, I feel like I need to get it. This is Purple Oud, which again, I'm loving. And I want like an oudy sort of scent to take to Dubai. So that could be an option. And then the last scent that she showed me was La 
Col Noir, which is lovely. It's very subtle and it's a rose scent and I don't really like rose, but this is gorgeous. Lovely. Honestly, if I showed you the sheer amount of samples that this girl gave me in flowers, <laughs> she was so cute in all fairness. So we've got like Chloe, Jimmy Choo, Another Jimmy Choo, Burberry, Dior, Dior, Jimmy Choo, Dior. And she gave me a skincare sample of this Shiseido uh, Vital Perfection Uplifting Cream. And I've had this before as a sample. I love it so much. It's such a good cream. Unfortunately, it's very expensive. So I think I might like save up and buy this because it is it is gorgeous, like it did things to my skin that nothing else has done before. Okay, and then lastly are the sunglasses that I bought. I'm not entirely sure. There we go. So, I don't know why, but I wasn't expecting them to come in the green Bottega, like, box. I don't know what I was expecting, but I'm very happy with this. Anyway, it's leather, it's gorgeous, I'm so excited. And then inside, a brand new pair. This was the last brand new pair because I said to her I didn't want the ones off the shelf. So thankfully that worked out in my favour. So we can remove the plastic. They're so extra. I love them so much though. Especially with my hair back. I feel like they look so good. I'm obsessed. I love them and I can't wait to wear them in Dubai. The, the YSL glasses that I have that are not in here, the ones that I've been wearing today are so, I, they're my favourite glasses, but because they're a bit more skinny and like cat eye, the sun comes down and it's really annoying. Whereas these, obviously, because they're a little bit bigger, are going to be perfect in Dubai and I'll always have my hair up because it'll be hot. I love the skinny arm and I don't have any like square angular glasses. So I love these. I think they look really good. I love them. <laughs> I'm so excited. So these are like tortoise, if you can see. And then, yeah, we've got the gold detail and they are obviously Bottega. Yeah, I love them. They're so big and they don't suit me and I love them. These, I think I look ridiculous, but also amazing. So that was the little splurge for today. And if I'm honest, I want to make more big splurges, but I need to control myself. I think these were like a little present to myself because I've been working really hard with my social media. I've been working hard anyway in my full-time job and I've been working really hard with my social media and things are coming to fruition. And I'm really, really like pleased and happy and grateful. So this is like a little reward to myself for now, just to keep myself going because I need to get my head down and keep going. I'm feeling very positive and motivated for this year. So I'm excited. I'm very excited. So on that note, it wouldn't be possible without all of you to have the opportunities that have been coming through to me. Um, so a big thank you to everyone who watches and engages with me on any social media platform. So a huge thank you and thank you for watching this vlog. And I will see you next week for another vlog. I don't know what it's going to be like. I'm going home home to my family home for my dad's birthday. So I'm very excited for that. But I don't know how much I'm going to film. But I will try my best. Anyway, see you next week. Bye.